Bob, so after a couple days of unsettled weather, we got a pretty nice day shaping up. Oh, mm -hmm. excited. Yes, Easter also looking pretty good. Just happened to have that Easter forecast for you. Let's take a look-see. Well, we're looking at partly cloudy skies and seasonable temperatures with a high right around 56 degrees. Also, the possibility of some light winds that day. Here's our weather headlines. Nice today. Some unsettled weather coming our way again on Thursday and Friday, so enjoy today. We're going to also turn down the wind machine. That wind made it feel kind of chilly yesterday at times. Well, we're going to turn it down today, but the winds return Thursday and Friday. Breezy to windy and uh, still a nice weekend shaping up for Easter weekend. Doppler Raiders just wanted to show you where the closest precip is, and it's hundreds of miles away uh, in eastern Idaho and uh, over there in Oregon. We have dry pavement out there this morning. It's uh, a little bit on the chilly side, 38 degrees. Winds pretty light at 6 miles per hour. Feels like temperature 33. For this Wednesday, March the 23rd, forecasting a high of 54 degrees. Again, just a bit below normal. Normal is 57, but our overnight low with some cloud cover will be a little bit milder tomorrow morning. There is our low pressure system. The center will track into Canada, but it's also going to drag this moisture into our area, but not today. Today, right here, we have a high pressure ridge building in, and that will keep us uh, nice and warm. It's been sliding eastward over the last uh, 24 hours, and today it dominates our weather with uh, just some high thin clouds at times, but uh, pretty nice day today. But in comes our weather maker for Thursday on into Friday. Here's our future cast, our high resolution future cast to give you some idea of the timing. This is around noon for today, 1145, pretty much cloud free skies across southwestern Idaho. Then the clouds start to increase as we head into uh, the evening hours and uh, just before midnight clouds increase leading to some showers. There's your morning commute tomorrow about 730. The possibility of some light rain showers. The rain will be pretty close to us. Throughout the day, there's 530, another shot of uh, some rain possible. It won't rain all day, and there's a 30% chance, so it's possible we won't get any showers at all, but they'll be close by. Definitely looking at some more cloud cover. Then as we head into Friday, Friday appears to be a little wetter, and the winds will be a little bit stronger. Good chance of seeing some showers in the noon hour tomorrow. There's uh, right around 1245, and then we'll start to see things clear up just in time for Saturday. The other story, the wind. Breezy conditions, pretty light today though, but as we head into Thursday, there's our breezy conditions, and then as we head into Friday, even stronger winds, especially in the afternoon hours, there's 530, sustained wind 19, so that means probably some gusts 25 to 30. So uh, then they'll die down as we head into Saturday. Regional forecast, mostly sunny and breezy for Twin Falls for Sun Valley, mostly sunny skies, only a slight chance of some snow showers, probably just some light flurries. Chance of some snow mainly this afternoon, convective type showers for McCall and Cascade, a function of the heating of the day. But down here in the valley, partly cloudy, western end, mostly sunny for Boise, high about 54. Here's our extended forecast. Two unsettled days coming our way, but not especially unsettled. And Friday, That'll feel pretty cool with that high of 50. So we'll be in the 40s much of the day, plus the wind will make it feel chillier. So kind of like yes, what we experienced yesterday, but uh, looking better for Saturday and Sunday. Then some more unsettled weather Monday and Tuesday. That's Lego weather.